Hello and welcome back. Hey, my name's C. Scott and I am so excited you guys can join us today because we got something, as always, we got something cool planned. Hey, but first, let's get an update on our building here. It's taken me some time. I, I just spent the last oh, about an hour and a half, two hours putting all these windows and up and everything. So, hey, go take a go take a look at this the video called Massive Projects, and uh, that'll show you what we're doing here. All right, but it's coming along. It's coming along slow because it's taking me time to to detail out this stuff. But again, look at all this, right? Sweet. So, you guys, we got this cool building. We talked about we're gonna go, you know. We're going to do some draconic evolution inside here, right? Absolutely, it's going to be the coolest thing ever. But if we're doing a an art deco-like building, or we're doing something in that aspect, or kind of that realm, I think we got to put some stuff inside this building that's going to be, be worthwhile. It's going to kind of match the theme. And I think that theme that we want to do is going to be immersive engineering. Okay, so that's what we're going to do today. Today we're going to get started on immersive engineering because it's, it takes a while longer. It's not a quick progression sort of, you know, mod that I can knock out in like 15 to 20 minutes and we'll be from, you know, point A to point B or tier 1 to tier 19. This one takes some time, so we're going to need to do that. So the first thing we're going to do is let's, let's start with, let's get us our manual, right? Uh, so let's uh, we'll come in here and we'll open our manual. It's just gonna where'd he go? There he is. There he is. Too easy, right? We got us a book and manual, and we'll get us a lever, a lever, and there we have an engineer manual, right? So this is a cool mod, and it and it, it, it there's a there's a guy that has put out a video. I think his name Systems Collapse. And with FTB Beyond, and, and he discusses the concept of immersive engineering internal to FTB Beyond, and it doesn't fit. And I, and I agree with him, but it's such a cool mod that we're going to go ahead and do it anyways. Um, and go check out his video because he makes a very, very valid point about the fact of immersive engineering is a, a very progression based mod. And in FTB Beyond, we can quickly run through it in no time. So the, the, we're going to start with treated wood. We got to get some treated wood, right? Because that starts everything. But to get treated wood, you got to have creosote. And the only way to get creosote is through. I uh, did that. Uh, where's he at? Um, it, it's. Let me. Yeah, I'm, I'm losing my mind here. It, it's basically construction not concrete or balloons we want uh, tools and simple machines okay simple enough here right uh, but really what we're looking for screw it we're going to NAI here we go I could sit here and tell you guys blah 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 and it's not gonna work right so the real thing is is we need to get a coke oven and we need to get a blast furnace and those are the two things that we got to start with so a coke a coke brick which is a coke oven let's see here if, if I can actually find it in here and show you guys I don't see anything coke oven there we go I just overlooked it completely so our coke oven is what gets us our creosote oil right and that is going to be nothing more than creating coke brick and laying it all out in a nine by nine area hitting it with this cool hammer and voila we are done so that brings me to the next point of what we got to create and that is going to be that our hammer so the engineer toolbox or the immersive engineering hammer and he is this right here okay and it, it, we should have enough for that so we've got now the immersive engineer hammer and let's go ahead and craft up enough coke brick which was where again forget it we'll just type it in <laughs> but coke brick immersive engineering we need a total of nine. Boom. What? We don't have any sandstone. You're right, we don't. Guys, I've been building that whole stinking building out of sandstone. <laughs> so we uh, we got more than enough. Uh, let's just create uh, a stack of it here. Come on. 
There we go. Oh, we got two stacks now. Ain't no big deal because I'm going to need it anyways. So here, so we want a total of nine, which we can all actually really do 10. So while we're in here, the other thing that we're going to need to do is, is a blast furnace. Okay. So a, a crude blast furnace is going to be uh, blast bricks. And again, we're going to need a total of 27. Oops. I probably should go back and make some more coke bricks we should we need a total of 27 all right so we'll get firing up here some nether brick which i don't know if we have nether brick and we'll start 64 if i'm rolling through there okay and while we're doing that let's get the rest of our coke so we need a total of 27 here what do we run out of bricks bricks we can't run out of bricks <laughs> it's okay guys it's okay because we have plenty of clay plenty right here we'll throw a little bit of it into here and it shouldn't take too long to smelt up and then we'll be good to go and we'll be able to rock this thing out so while that's doing that um we want to do all of it we want to do it all yeah we'll do it all um so while that's cooking and while we are let's let's look at the last thing uh, we should have, oh, we're gonna need more brick, right? Another brick. So what's 27 divided by two, which is actually becomes 28 divided by two, which is 14. So 14 times four is roughly a lot more than what we got right now. So that's okay. So let's grab clay. Well, look at that and look at that, right? I wonder if our digital miner can bust that clay up. Yes, it can. So we'll put it up there where it goes real fast. <laughs> Look at this. I love this thing here. Oh, there it is. Look how fast that stuff goes. It's just phenomenally how cool it is. Let's here. Watch it come in. 300, 370, 390, and we're done. Right? That is cool. Uh, let's grab some clay and we'll just grab two stacks of it throw it in there and there and one in here split it up and if you guys don't know what I'm what I'm throwing in here this is the engineers workshop the engineer the workshop table from engineer workshop go back and check out that video because this thing is super super cool too uh, just awesome mod that that I found was told about and it is cool because it does a lot of stuff um, and see how quickly that processes that out that's that's super awesome okay so that's done and we can probably go ahead and make the rest of our cook brick here so we had 16 18 you get in there get in there so we just need a total of 10 more coke brick all right okay so that is great and the next thing we got to do is a blast furnace and it is right here we need a total of 28 of those oh my goodness we ran out of blaze powder blaze powder how do we get blaze powder because i'm too lazy to go to the nether actually <laughs> hold up here maybe did, did, oh look at this who in the right mind would go when you have eight thousand blaze rods Oh, what a stinker am I? You know what? Hey, watch this. So we'll go back to the engineer's workshop, the, the the table here, right? And in this table here, we can we can it'll it'll automatically do all of this for us too. So on this one, we have it where it it uh, it'll grind the materials. And if you look at the upgrades, we have a sag mill in here, and so it just drops up. Look at that. <laughs> Guys, we are sitting super fat with with materials. This is this is so awesome. Blast furnace, and we will we can now finish our blast furnace. So we need another ten. Boom. Okay. So I think that we're gonna come out here and place this guy out here somewhere. I don't know where I want to put him yet. Let's. Well, yeah, we gotta go check that out. You guys will think that's cool here in a second. Let's. Nah, all right, in here, in here. We got this big, beautiful building that we've not really done anything with. So we're gonna put him in here, okay? 
What do you think? Yeah, 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 yeah. This will work. Or do we want to go upstairs? Nah, upstairs is too cool. We, we're going to put it right here in the middle. So we're going to put a blast furnace, and then we're going to put a coke furnace. And these will ultimately get upgraded, and we will we'll, we'll put them, move them somewhere else. But for now, this this should work. Yeah, 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 yeah. Right? Okay, so there's our blast furnace. Now we ain't going to hit it with a hammer yet, because you guys will see what we're going to do with it. Then we'll put the coke furnace right here. Just a little bit of room to get around here when we're doing this. But yeah, so this is cool. These the immersive engineering has some really cool stuff with it, all right? It's just cool looking. So we're gonna take our hammer, we're here, and we we pop it. Left click or right click with it, and we are good to go. And now our blast furnace, if I can move in here, boom, right? Hot topic, really hot topic we now have. And then it's just easy, right? Okay, so we got that, we got this one. So in here, we need to drop some coal, if I remember right. And we have more than enough coal, so we'll drop 64 coal right into here. And that'll start processing. And this takes a while, guys. I mean, it takes a long time for this to process. But when it produces, it's gonna produce cold coke. And that cold coke is also gonna produce the uh, creosote. And the creosote is what we need to make our treated wood. And then we'll take cold coke, and we'll come over here and we will drop it into here with iron and that will ultimately smelt us up steel now are there other ways we can make steel yes there are because we're in modded minecraft but you know what we're going to do it this way with this because eh, it's what else do we got but time what else do we got but time plenty of time so that is kind of all we're going to get to today when it comes to immersive engineering only for the simple fact that it, it it's going to take us some time so while i build the building since he's looking good right you guys uh, it's taking time but we'll get the building built and when the time it comes right we'll have all of our immersive engineering stuff ready to go into that cool building but before i let you go i'm gonna come over here and in the last episode we did a quick tutorial on how to level up our tinkers tools automatically by not having to do anything so i've been on for about two hours today and yesterday we started when we made this we were at 9,000 xp and we are at 27 right now and all i've done is keep coming in i replace it and, and let me show you guys it real quick before we let you go and we throw this in here pop it back out and then our hammer goes and we throw it back into our cool automated adventurer is what i'm going to call it adventurer and it goes in there and it just goes and it slacks all of that cobblestone it sucks it all back up puts it back into the system and rolls right through there and, and look at that 2850 oh man yeah 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 that's that's working well it's really really well and it takes no energy no energy at all it is all automated so that is cool but guys Hey, I'm going to let you go, but uh, I appreciate you all stopping by to help me start some immersive engineering because it, it's a it's a pretty cool mod. It's a little out of place here in FTB Beyond, but it, it is a cool mod. And I think one of the things I really want to do with it, I was looking at it earlier because, you know, again, you know, 1.10.2 is a little bit different than 1.7.10. And I saw something real cool in here that I, I want to make. And where is he at? Let, let's see if I can find it. Right here. Gun turret. We're going to make one of them gun turrets here soon. Very, very cool. Because it's cool. Kim Thrower. I don't know what this one does either, but we're going to try it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Gun turrets. Gun turrets on our building. And that'll be fun. So that's that's what we're going to shoot for with some other things with immersive engineering. But I, I want to I wanna, I wanna make a gun turret because that looks cool. But hey, guys, until next time. Hey, I'm C. Scott, and I really, really appreciate y'all, you know, coming out with me today because uh, we're going to get to cooler stuff. We're just in that lull right now as we build our building and prep for everything that's going to go into it. So until next time, we'll catch you all again very, very soon. Mm -hmm.